This video is over events. Events. And then all the event is is a subset, a subset of the sample space of the sample sample space space space. So an event we could do is event event A, and we'll say event A is getting the king of hearts. The king of hearts. That's event A. So what's the probability of event A? Event A. Now assuming we have an entire deck of cards, so 52 cards, and we pull out one card, what's the probability of it being the king of hearts? Well, event A is one outcome, is one outcome of the 52 possible outcomes. So that is the probability of event A. Now let's say we have event B. Event B, and we'll say event B is just getting maybe a diamond of any kind. A diamond it could be the ace of diamonds, the king of diamonds, any card that has a diamond on it. So event B could be, I guess another way of writing that would be the ace of diamonds, the ace of diamonds, the uh, two of diamonds, two of diamonds, three of diamonds, and so on till the queen of diamonds and the king of diamonds. So that is event B. So event B is a total of 13, so I guess the probability of event B, probability of event B is 13 outcomes. So if you get any one of these outcomes, any one of these 13 outcomes, event B will have occurred. So the probability of event B is the outcomes of event B, which is 13, divided by 52, if we assume we just pull one out of the deck, pull one card out of the deck. And that is just simply 1 and 4. 1 and 4. Now let's have another event. Event. Event C. And C can be either a diamond, so any of the diamonds, or any of the clubs. Or let's just do hearts. So it can be any of the diamonds or hearts. So again, that would be, it could either be the Ace of Hearts, the Ace of Hearts, or the Ace of Diamonds, so on, until we get to the King of Hearts and the King of Diamonds. King of Diamonds. So Event C, Event C, the probability of Event C, probability of C is equal to the number of possible outcomes for Event C. So if we have any of the diamonds count for event C, or any of the hearts count for event C, so that is 26, 26 outcomes out of the 52 possible outcomes, or just 1 out of 2. So it's basically 50%. So the probability of event C is 50%. And remember, an event is just a subset of the sample space.